Yo, what is up everybody? It is your boy Gerson here. I know that was a really cheesy intro, but had to do it. That's just me. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about a new little gadget that you might have heard of. The new iPhone 8. I got the Plus model right here and you can clearly see the uh, nice uh, glass back with all my smudges and all the uh, reflections that are going on right now. Um, yeah, I wasn't actually a big fan of the Plus model when they first came out with the 6, I believe. Um, but since I'm into videography and photography and all that stuff, the bigger screen definitely helps. Um, yeah, I still have uh, my 6 right here, and I really like this size. It just fits so well in the palm of your hand, but it started glitching. Um, and going just really slow when running multiple apps and all that stuff. So, in the words of Demi Lovato, you just don't do it for me, iPhone 6. So, here we go with the iPhone 8 Plus. I'm really gonna dive into the camera um, as far as like the video quality with the 4K video quality is insane. I'm really gonna talk about the camera overall since I'm such a huge nerd when it comes to videography and photography. So, let's just go ahead and dive in. Little cheat sheet here, cause I did not do my research. So it's got the two cameras, as you can see right there, um, just like the iPhone 7. It's got the wide angle at f-stop at 1.8 and the telephoto lens at f-stop 2.8. So pretty good with low, with low light. I've put together a little edit of me using the camera in different settings, whether it be 4K, 24 frames, 60 frames, uh, slow-mo at 240 frames, and then of course, just actually taking pictures with it. Um, so here it is. Another really cool feature that Apple integrated into the camera with the iPhone 8 was the studio lighting. Uh, which is a really cool feature, just changing the different lighting effects, to just to change your overall mood and tone of the photos that you take. One effect I was really looking forward to in particular was the stage lighting. It just completely blacks out the background and it looks super cool in the commercials. Um, so I was really excited to give that a try once I got the iPhone 8 Plus. So we can go ahead and take a look at that right now. Uh, here's a photo of my friend David. Um, with the uh, studio, the stage light, with the stage light effect. I will show you the natural light. Right there. Back to stage. The reason I asked them to put a hood on was I noticed that in the Apple commercials, all the models in the photos had long hair. They were all covering their ears. Um, it kind of cuts out the ears weird a little bit. I'll show you another photo um, right here. You can kind of see right there that kind of doesn't do so well around his head, around his ear. Um, but I mean, it's not bad. But I think it's, you know, it's still in the beta version. So hopefully we get an updated version of that in the next update soon. So again, my name is Gerson. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like it, leave a comment below, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time.